Surexit Dominus and welcome to Gloria TV News. Castel Gandolfo. The health of Benedict XVI has dramatically diminished in the last two weeks, Paloma Gomez Borrero wrote Tuesday night in the Spanish paper El Mundo. According to her, Benedict suffers from something, quote, very severe. She adds, we won't have him with us for very much longer. Hi guys. All right, well, France has something planned up his sleeves. Here it is over on his uh, uh, Facebook page. Benedict XVI currently in grave health despite Vatican denials. This is so typically um, bullshit news, as you've all been used to. Well, the Vatican reiterated Wednesday that Benedict XVI does not have any specific illness apart from the problems associated with old age after a Spanish author claimed the Pope Emeritus must have a grave illness after suffering a dramatic deterioration in his health. Paloma Gomez Barrero, a correspondent at the Vatican, said Benedict XVI's health had dramatically diminished over the past 15 days, adding that one can only, and then it goes on, because they have been beating him up. Have, must have something very serious. We won't have him for us very much longer, she said in a report in the Spanish newspaper ABC. It is unlikely that the Pope Emeritus will ever appear again in public. She said Gomez made the comments on Tuesday at the launch of her new book on the conclave called From Benedict to Francis. The journalist added the Pope's decision to resign was a very bitter chalice for him and that he showed great humility in doing so. But speak, speaking to the Register Wednesday, Vatican spokesman Father Federico Lombardi said that Benedict has no illness and that the problems are those connected with age. His comments are consistent with Vatican statements on this issue since Benedict announced his resignation on February 11th. So you can see the play here, there's something up his sleeve that uh, let us tell you that Benedict is protected. Nothing will happen to Benedict. And come what may, should there be a funeral, uh, should there be any show of uh, Benedict having passed away, it will be a total and absolute hoax and fabrication. Now, as it turns out, there are people actually beginning to wake up to this out there, and uh, some who have actually committed to do anything that they can to help get the news out and with their own resources privately investigate what is going on with Benedict. Right. So, well, also, Benedict, yeah. Now, also, when Benedict found us, the, the first thing that uh, we did, of course, was get him onto protocols where uh, he regained his strength and his vigour. And, of course, he was speaking to the source of all life. So uh, he bounded right back. So all these reports of illness um, may have been true before he retired because that is the reason that he did retire. However, he was restored to health once he found Christum reincarnate, the Christ reincarnate Brian Lenigo, Lightning Marshall. So that's what we warned you about. That's what's happening over there with the Antichrist, Francis.